You want to skip the monotony. You want to skip the boredom. You want to skip the robotic tasks. You want to skip the repetition and go straight to the success. Does not work that way. You got to live in the monotony. You got to get down in the mud of the boring. You got to trudge through the robotic stuff long enough until you don't have to anymore. Hey, what's up, everyone? I'm John Darden, and this is the Elite Realtor Experience, a podcast dedicated to agents ready to take the next step in becoming elite. First and foremost, before we dive in, I have been asking this, and I'm going to ask you again. If you enjoy listening to this, if this is helpful for you, if you're getting value from this, if this is helping you uh, obtain a result in the business, if you are finding ready, willing, enable buyers and sellers from this, if it's helping you uh, enjoy the industry more, enjoy your life more. If you are seeing any sort of result from this, please, please, please give me a five-star review. Don't just hit that five-star though. Give me a quick little sentence or two. Like, how is this helping you? How is this benefiting you? That would mean the absolute world to me. If you were a listener and have never given a review, please take a second and do that. Bailey's going to give me a review right after this. Thanks, Bailey. Like, hey, you haven't done that yet, you big jerk. Let's get into this. Agents, new agents, seasoned agents, somewhere in between, it doesn't matter. Agents, we have to learn to be okay in the monotony of the same repetitive thing every single day. I know why you got in this business. You wanted your freedom. Oh, I just want to be free. Well, sorry. Any, any sales job, any entrepreneurial activity is a lot of repetitions, a lot of doing the same thing over and over and over and over and over. And if you listen and, and digest and take the things that I teach to heart and try to manifest them into your business, then you probably have five, six, seven lead generating sources that you are time blocking into your week every single week. And you probably are starting your day off with a good morning routine, your morning at the office, you're focusing on your lead generation tasks, having real estate conversations, reaching out to people, uh, whether it's cold calls or reaching out to Sphere or following back up with people. You're having conversations with people you know, people you don't know, and following back around with people, uh, back up with people that you've had conversations with in the past in order to set an appointment. The four appointment types are a listing presentation or a listing consultation, a buyer interview, a showing, or a face to face meeting like lunch, coffee, a get together that could lead to one of the previous three. You're spending your afternoons working on projects and going on appointments. You are spending your evenings, depending on your life stage, either going on appointments, family time, dinner with clients, potentially you're having a good nighttime routine. Your days probably look very similar every single day, which if you are the artist type, which you probably are as a realtor, we're the free willing, nilly, nilly, willy, free wheeling, nilly, willy. That's hard to say. Free willing, nilly, willy, free willing, free wheeling, free wheeling, nilly, willy. It's a challenge. Say that three times fast. Free wheeling, nilly, willy personality type. We're the artists. We, we don't want to be put in a box. But if you're going to be successful in real estate, you have to put yourself in a box. You have to. And this is a short, simple podcast. Last couple of podcasts have been a little shorter because the point is simple. And I, and I don't feel like I have to go into too much explanation here. If you want to be successful as a real estate agent, you got to be okay doing the same thing every single day. No matter how monotonous it becomes, no matter how. Oh, my nose is so bad. Oh, God. Uh, wow, that hit me like a ton of bricks. I had to stop. Oh, my nose is watering. I was trying to power through it and I couldn't do it. Whew, back on. I don't think we'll edit that out. We'll just keep it going. No matter how boring. And, and so many people complain about this. You, you hit me up on Insta or somebody inside my brokerage complains about how boring real estate can feel and that's not why you got into this because you wanted it to be free and so much fun every day and every day is new and every day is exciting well guess what you ain't gonna be successful if you're doing that 
Now, at some point, you earn the right to be free wheeling nilly willy. Uh, said it correct that time. You earn that right, but you got to earn the right. And the only way you earn the right is to consistently do the same tasks every single day day over and over again and yes it gets boring yes it gets monotonous yes it's not quote unquote fun all the time it's challenging it's hard it's why the best rise to the top and it's why those that can't handle it get out agents that are successful can go back in time and tell you about the times that it felt very boring They can tell you about the times that it felt very monotonous. They can tell you about the times that they felt like a robot. But agents that do well for a time, and maybe even still, very much approach this career like it was a nine to five, punching the clock. Because they knew that if they didn't approach it that way, then their artist personality type would not allow them to accomplish what they needed to accomplish because they get distracted by this and they would get bored and so they go do this thing over here and never accomplish the task that actually move the needle of their business forward. Agents, if you want to be successful, you want to have a big business, be okay living in, in the monotony. Be okay living in the boredom. Be okay living in the robotic routine. Same thing every single day. Until you have earned the right and you have done the monotonous thing so repetitively for so long that you no longer have to do that. And that day will come. There is light at the end of the tunnel, but some of you want to skip the tunnel and go straight to the light. That's a societal issue. And it's a problem that I see, honestly, it doesn't matter the the age range. Like This isn't a, a millennial versus Gen Z versus boomer thing. This is an agent thing. You want to skip the monotony. You want to skip the boredom. You want to skip the robotic tasks. You want to skip the repetition and go straight to the success. Does not work that way. You got to live in the monotony. You got to get down in the mud of the boring. You got to trudge through the robotic stuff long enough until you don't have to anymore. And if you're at that point, congratulations. But if you're not at that point, be okay with it. Embrace the monotony, embrace the boredom, embrace the robot, because that is how you become successful. See you on the next one.